Hey there everyone, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart and welcome to another Minecraft mod review. And today I'm showcasing the Mutant Creatures mod by the Hippo Master 12, which features both creepers and zombies, but an incredibly huge and terrifying new form. The first one we're going to look at is the Mutant Zombie, as it's a little bit less destructive and then we'll move on to the big bad creeper so what this mod essentially does is adds a few new mobs to the game namely a mutant zombie and mutant creeper but there's one more that we'll get into near the end so let's dive straight in and have a look at the mutant zombie so here i've got the egg for a mutant zombie you can spawn them in in creative mode and i'm just gonna straight up put him straight in i need to put on easy i'm gonna put him straight in here and show you what he looks like he is crazily looking so this is what he looks like he is a beast. Look at that guy. Wow. So he's like a massive Hulk. I think he could take on the Hulk, basically. And he has three different attacks, so I'm going to have to move into creative mode. Um, I'm going to have to move into survival mode here. Game mode zero. And watch him attack. So he has three attacks. The first one is melee like this, and wow. That's crazy. He like slams the ground and puts this massive like earthquake up against you. And that does... Quite a bit of damage. You can do up to 12 damage and makes you hungry as well. But I'm wearing diamond armor, so he's not going to do that. He has another attack, which is like a raw attack, which... Um, res wow, wow, oh my god! That's a slam attack. That's his pretty craziest attack. So that deals full damage and actual damage as well. So he scoops you up and flicks you down. Uh, oh, god, this guy's crazy. Yep, he's made me hungry. And I'm trying to get him to do the raw attack. The raw attack is where he resurrects zombies from the grave. God damn it, do the raw! He resurrects zombies and they just come after you like normal zombies. So, can I get him to do it? He just wants to slam me in the head. Oh god! Oh god, this is the best attack by far. Look how much damage I did. I am wearing diamond armor. Wow. So let's try and kill this guy. Oh! So these guys actually have 60, um, 60 hearts of health, which is crazy. So this is going to take ages to kill. And there's a special clause for killing him at the end. So when he's dead, you may think he's dead, but he's just on the floor. He's just playing dead. Look at him. He's on the floor. You have to incinerate the guy. So you have to set him on fire. And if you don't, he'll get up within seven seconds. Just like that. I didn't set him on fire quick enough. Here's the raw attack. Oh, the raw attack. <sighs> Not only do you receive damage if you're near him, but it will resurrect zombies. So here they are. Here's his zombie pals. And oh, God, they're coming again. <laughs> Oh wow, this guy is crazy. I need to kill this guy again. So as you saw, if you don't kill him quick enough, he will just come back to life within seven seconds. So you need to set him on fire and burn the crap out of him. So why aren't you dying? Wow. Come on. He keeps just doing the raw attack. Wow. Die! I will set you on fire so badly. Oh, he's almost gone. He's got why? God. Come on, he must die now. Oh god, his minions are after me. Oh god. Oh god. Go and die. Yes! Oh yeah! <laughs> and what is supposed to drop? Come on. Come on. Come on. I think it burnt in the fire. So I'll grab it from creative mode. So let's go back into creative mode. Um, and what he drops when you kill him is a hammer. So if I get this, it's the Hulk hammer. And switch back into game mode zero. And what this does is pretty much give you his melee attack in a hammer. So if I right click, it will do the melee attack. And you get 64 uses out of it before it dies. So that is really awesome. Let's use you on this cow here. Hello, Mr. Cow. How are you doing here? Whoop, lag. <laughs> oh, oh, come here. Come here. <laughs> so that's incredible. I need some food. I need some food up in here. So that was the mutant zombie. He's a pretty crazy guy. That throwing attack is insane. So we are going to now look at the mutant creeper. So you can spawn these in as usual as well. So I'm just going to walk over here because he is going to cause some ridiculous damage. So here he is. He is pretty ugly. He's got four massive legs. He's just like a long necked creeper. Look, he's disgusting. Wow. Look at him. He's just, hey, hey. Come back here. Well, what he does is he does a lot of different attacks. He has a direct push attack, which he just pushes you out of the way, basically. A jump attack where he explodes. And let's just show this, actually. Game mode. Hopefully, I don't die. Um, here we go. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's pushing me. That's his simple, like, headbutt attack. And then he can do, like, a jumping attack as well. So, let's see if you can get him to do that. I don't want him to blow up that chest because that would be pretty annoying. Come on. Do another attack for me. You're going to do it, or are you just going to attack me? Wow. Ah! Ah! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? 
Come after me, dude. Come after me. He has so many different attacks, and he's just only doing the one. You sir, you sir, you need to do you need to do a different attack. They, well, these have six anyway. <laughs> yeah, these have sixty damage that you need to do some. They have six, oh my god, here it is. <laughs> so what it does is it jumps into midair, and then as it lands, it makes a massive explosion. See, so stop. Oh, here's a charge attack as well. Wow, thanks for showing this, this guys. Thank you, Vizioni. It's he does. Uh. <laughs> I don't know what that was. But anyway, he does a charge attack and what he does is he explodes at the end. And he's also got this attack just like the zombie where he can um, like spawn these mini creepers that come straight after you. So that's awesome too. He's also got yeah the charge attack which he just showed you. And one in eight times of that charge attack he'll create a... I don't know where these explosions are coming from. He'll do a um, lightning attack which just charges him up and makes him even stronger. So let's try and kill this guy. He needs to go down. He's not as strong as the zombie, I don't think. The zombie does a ridiculous amount of damage. Here we go. Oh, I've killed him. And he's going to do a massive blow. Oh, my God. Did you see that? <laughs> when he blows up, when you kill him, he does this the biggest explosion that he can create. And then he drops this little egg thing. So this egg you can actually wear on your head. You can wear three to four stacked on top of your head, which is pretty crazy. But what you can also do is explode this egg to make it hatch faster. But otherwise, it will take around uh three to five days to hatch and what it hatches into i'm just gonna try damn you damn you i'm just gonna fly over to my chest which thankfully he did not destroy so what he does what happens is you get this thing i've got it in my hot bar i'm so dumb so what happens when you hatch this egg is this you get this thing called a creeper minion which is basically what he sets out but this one is yours so you get a mini creeper that's all yours and he will attack as normal you can right click him and he will sit i think it's in the wrong mode but he will attack things as well so that's pretty nice and there's more stuff as well. So what you can also do, you can craft a creeper stats kind of... I'm not even sure what that is, like a axe, I don't really know. But if you take four cobblestone and gunpowder in the middle, you can get the creeper stats item. And what this does is pretty much show you the stats of your creeper. Where's our little creeper gone? There he is, hiding in the grass. But he shows you the stats of the creeper. Oh, the grass is in the way. Let me switch over the game modes. Oh god! What are you doing?! You idiot! No! Stop doing that! <laughs> so it's not going to happen because I haven't hatched him properly. But what you can do is check the stats of the egg. So I'll show up a screenshot for it now, what it actually looks like. You can change the name and check how often, how big of his explosions are, how much health he's got and stuff. And if you get gunpowder and right click on him, he will regain health if he's a, a lower health than his maximum. And if he is at his maximum health, you will be able to not just healing but you'll be able to make his maximum health even more so that's really cool too and there's one more thing i need to show you so in here is a creeper shard so what this creeper shard does is it acts as a weapon for you to use which acts like a creeper so right now it's fully charged as soon as you get it and if you right click it will explode the land around you so as you can see the durability is completely gone and how you make that come back is how you, you just kill mobs it's pretty awesome you just kill mobs it will charge up and then you'll be able to unleash different attacks i don't know what is going on here so let me just switch back over to i've typed that wrong pretty much every time so let's try and get out of here because that glitched a little bit and go back and as you kill mobs the durability will charge up and you'll be able to do different kinds of attacks so as you can see i'm getting a little bit of uh Dur durability on it and i can unleash a smaller attack which is cool so that was just like a small really small attack and as you're using it you also get poisons so there's a little downside to using it but it's a really cool weapon which yeah pretty much devastates when it's on full power so that has pretty much been the mutant creatures mod thank you all for watching i hope you enjoyed the mod if you did then please go and get it in the description below there'll be a link for you to click and it'll take you straight to the minecraft forum page please tell them that dan sent you from the diamonds minecart and if you also did enjoy the video please leave a like and subscribe if you are new to the channel. You can also find Facebook and Twitter